High school graduation is an exciting milestone for many, but some students in the District School Board of Niagara say they're not happy with their upcoming graduation date. Eric Vino joins us live in studio with more on this. Eric? Hi Adam, I spoke with two students who go to Eden High School in St. Catharines. They say the school board's plan to hold graduation ceremonies weeks earlier than in previous years is frustrating. They even started a petition that shows that many other students in the board feel the same way. 10,000 is the number we're trying to reach because then they, they need to take us seriously. This is like, this is not just Eden affected, it's all DSPN schools that really care about this issue and just want a proper celebration. Back in October, Eden High School student Olivia Gillespie found out that her high school graduation would be much different than what she expected. It would originally happen the day after exams, so it would be, I believe, June 27th, that kind of area, depending on the school. But now we were given a window between, I think it was May 21st and June 11th, and our graduation date now is June 11th. So that's before exams, so the next day we would just have to go right back to school. It's a change other students are not happy with as well, like Manuela Jaren, who has joined Gillespie in her effort to hold the graduation ceremony after exams. Okay, I go to school Monday, go to this little celebration Tuesday, and then wake up Wednesday morning. No, I would rather use my Tuesday night to study for the exams that I have. The two students say that a proper high school graduation is extremely important for them because the pandemic disrupted another major graduation almost four years ago. The same thing happened to us in grade eight. We didn't get a graduation. We had to go back at the end of the school year just to pick up our diplomas and medals and things like that, like just a package, right? And the same thing is going to have to happen here, right? Because if we're going back to school the next day, we haven't officially received our diplomas or medals yet, so it would just be the same thing. Along with starting a petition, both Gillespie and Jaren have contacted multiple board representatives, including the DSBN Superintendent of Curriculum and Student Achievement for Secondary Schools. But they say they're not getting answers. You're listening to us, but you're not really hearing us. Like you're not really paying attention to the things that we are saying. And that is so crucial. If your entire thing is student voices matter, student voice matter, we're here for you. You're not demonstrating that. We shouldn't have to fight this hard to get something we deserve. I reached out to the DSBN to talk about its decision to change the graduation dates, but they were unable to speak today. Gillespie and Jaren say they plan to attend a board meeting on January 24th to bring up the issue again. So far, their petition has over 3,000 signatures. Back to you.